Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Way Slam reviewer, and I'm here to review Bad Sports, and this is a new documentary series on Netflix, and this first season has six episodes focusing on scandals that happen in the realm of sports. And basically, each episode is directed by a different person, but each of them develop a pretty good sense of tension and suspense in regards to the scandals that they're trying to present in each episode through some really solid storytelling. Um, I like to use the first episode as an example with the story about the Arizona State University basketball team and how two of the players were uh, fixing points. And, you know, cutting back between interviewing of the two players and the guy that roped them into it and, you know, how they built the suspense of, like, one night... He, like, the one guy fell asleep and wakes up the next morning. He's, like, about to go check the score. What happened? Ticker's about to turn, and then it cuts back to the two athletes talking about the actual game and, like, being able to keep the audience on their seat, building that suspense, what happened. And at that point in the episode, you've been through, like, a good 40 minutes, and you're just, like, glued to the... TV, laptop, phone, wherever you're watching this on Netflix, and really just feeling like, I need to know what happened. And each of these episodes is a little over an hour to like, I think the second episode, which was dealing with like marijuana and race cars, was like an hour and 24 minutes. So some of these could be a little beefy in terms of like solo episodes of a show, but they're very interesting and intriguing in how the story plays out, building tension, their quality interviews, they have a good atmosphere that builds some suspense and intrigue along the way. This isn't anything fancy, this isn't anything that is like earth shattering from like a documentarian perspective, but it does bring up the seedy, darker underbelly of the sports world, and that's a big part of it. The money-making aspects of it, and how it tarnishes the competition, the honor, the code that these athletes take up to do these sports, and getting to see some real tension in terms of like what's what's getting them involved in doing this, what inspired them to do this, and each episode builds up an interesting story that takes you on an interesting ride. Some of them might be a little over long, but in general, I think this is a really fine series, and especially if you're in like that true crime stuff and you're also a sports fan, this is right up your alley then, combining those two things, both in effective ways, and giving us a chance to really take it in and get compelled by some interesting and crazy stories of scandals in the sports world and told with some really good storytelling to be able to keep that tension up. So, you know, if this sounds like something you're interested in, you like the true crime, you like sports, go check this one out right now on Netflix. But those are my thoughts on bad sports. Let me know what you think, and let's talk some TV. But thank you, as always, for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.